Good morning. Welcome back. I'm so glad everyone got to join us again today. We are here with Summer in Action Virtual Camp 2020. We'll be here all week starting at 10 for the live session. If you can't make it for the live session, we will also have a videotaped session in the afternoon shared. This week we're talking about rhythm and rhyme. Please, we are also taking comments um, or questions on our Facebook Live. So while we're doing this, if you have anything you'd like to share or say, please do so so we can interact with you all a little bit too, okay? My name is Miss Tara. I'm Miss Ruthann. I'm so happy you guys came back. Miss Tara, I'm happy you came back. Yes. So we have some songs and dancing that we're going to do. We have so much fun today. Are you ready to start, Miss Tara? Whenever you are. I'm ready. All right. We're going to start with a song, and I know all of my friends are familiar with this song. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. And eyes, and ears, and mouth, and nose. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. This is so much fun, Tara. I see your smile. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Head, Shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes, and eyes, and ears, and mouth, and nose, head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. I pointed to the wrong body part. That's okay, Miss Tara. We're, we're all learning. We are all learning. I got so excited. I know, it is exciting. So today's objectives are, I can sustain attention to a rhyme, I can recognize rhyming sounds, and I can identify shapes. So today, we are gonna be focusing on shapes. Okay, Tara, I have this, this poem like we've had all week, so I'm gonna start reading it. I, I'm a mama circle round like a pie. I'm baby triangle, Three sides have I. I am Papa Square. My sides are four. I'm Cousin Rectangle, shaped like a door. I am Brother Oval, shaped like a zero. I'm Sister Diamond with a sparkle and a glow. We are the shapes that you all know. Look for us wherever you go. So if you get in your bags for Wednesday, Miss Tara, would you like yes. to show them? I was just thinking that you need to get out your shape song bag packet for today. It has everything in here that you'll need and that you'll also need some crayons to crayons. color with in our journal yes, at the end. Definitely. So your packet and some crayons, please. So Miss Tara, do you want to hold these up yes. while we talk you about You should have our these in your shapes. packet. Those are in your packet. If you can pull these out as she reads the um, poem, we're going to hold up the shapes that go along with the words that she's reading, okay? Hey, okay. I'm a mama circle round like a pie. Look at Miss Tara's circle. It goes round and round Does like it a have pie. any sides, Miss Tara? It's just a circle. Just a circle. Round and round. And it's sort of like a clock a lollipop, a button that you might find on your clothes. What else is something in their house, Miss Tara? Friends, look around your house, your living room or your kitchen. Is there anything that you can see that's shaped like a circle? I think maybe a doorknob would be a circle. Ooh, a doorknob, some, some a clock on the a wall. Clock. Your look, turf. My turtle. <laughs> That's exactly what it I was thinking. It is a circle. My turtle is a circle. This is a trash can lid that we found outside, and we made it into a turtle. I think our friends are finding all kinds of circles uh, at look home. Look at my earrings, Miss <gasps> Tara. Wow. There, there's how many circles? One, two, three. Three circles. I learned that yesterday, yes. holding up three fingers. Yeah. <laughs> I'm baby triangle. Three sides have I. One, One two, three. three. Oh. <gasps> Pizza, pizza is cut like a triangle. Pizza is cut like a triangle. Yeah. Oh, tortilla chips. Chips. Yield sign. Yield sign. Birthday, uh, I say birthday cake. cake, any cake, I guess. Yeah. Uh, paper airplanes, those are all triangles. Yeah. You think the friends could find some triangles in their household? I'll bet you they could. Well, Let's think. Look at, think about your house, Miss Tara. Is there anything sure. that's shaped like a triangle in your house? 
Hmm. That's a hard one. Yeah. I'm thinking my spatula that picks up pies that and cakes. That picks up pie. That would, yeah, yes. That's, that's a triangle, triangle shape. That's a triangle. Okay. I am Papa Square. My sides are four. Four sides. One, One two, two, three, four. four. Four sides. Look at those items that could be squares at home. Your window. <laughs> I like that window. Fly swatter. Ooh, a cracker. Cheese crackers. Cheese crackers. Dice, your pillow, or your blanket. Yes. What else is a square in your... Your TV. Your TV or your computer that you're looking at right now is square. Mm -hmm. Let's see what else might hmm. be a square at the house. A picture on a wall? A picture on a wall. Those could be squares. That's a good idea. I'm cousin rectangle shaped like a door. Yep, it has four sides Door. like a square, but it's got two long sides yes. and two short sides on a rectangle. So a door is a great example of a rectangle. Or a suitcase or your paper, maybe your paper that you're writing at in your journal. Uh, that is a triangle. A rectangle. Rectangle. They say great a present. Great job, you guys. Can you find one in your house? Oh, I think they're doing a great job they finding these shapes. They are doing such a great job. I am brother oval shaped like a zero. I don't have a shape for we that one, but I thought I might be able to use my hands and show what an oval might well, be. I can draw an oval. Oh. Here, I'll draw an oval. Kind of a circle that's been kind of stretched. Like an egg. Like an egg. An egg is a good example. Egg's a good what oval. What else in your home? That's a hard one, too. Yeah. It wouldn't be a golf ball because a golf no, ball is a circle. It's a circle. That wouldn't be an oval. An oval is Very. a little more stretched out. I would say an egg is a good one. Egg's a good one. I'm Sister Diamond with a sparkle and a glow. Miss so Ruthann. There is two names for a diamond, isn't yep. there? We like to call it a diamond, but we also like to call it a rhombus. rhombus. Can you say that big word with us? Rhombus. Good job. A rhombus looks like a diamond. Mm -hmm. Things that you might have at home, Miss Ruthann, look at that. Earrings. Earrings. No. I don't have any of those on today. A that kite. Like that. Oh. Ooh, a diamond ring. Diamond rings. And a crosswalk sign. Signs. A lot of your signs, when you are out driving with your family, you will see rhombus or diamond-shaped signs. It has a picture of a sock, but they're talking about the design, the design on the sock. On there. Yeah. I'm thinking blankets yeah. might have it. These oh. are, I thought at first these were rhombuses, but they're like seashells. Oh, they're close. Was that all of them, Miss Tara? Yes. We are the shapes that you all know. Look for us wherever you go. You want to show them again? Okay. Okay, friends, what was this one? A circle. Great job. And a triangle. This is has four sides. One, two, three, four. And it's a... Good job. Square. You guys are Good so job. smart. And a rectangle. You know what, Miss Terry? It has four sides, too. It One, does. One, two, three, four. How are they different? These sides look all the same. They're the same length. And then the rectangle has the two. Two long and then two short. Short ones. Hmm. Yep. And then oh. this is, it has two names. We're going to call it the big one, the... Rhombus or diamond, and it also has four sides. Yeah, and then that's, that's, it. that's all of them. Circle doesn't have any corners, it just goes no round corners, and round. Let's look at this again because I noticed something, Miss Sarah, when I was reading it that some of these words sounded the same. Oh, you have rhyming words? I have rhyming words in here oh, too. They sound the same. I'm a mama's circle, round like a pie. I'm baby triangle, three sides have I. Which two of those words sound the same at the end? Like and have, those don't sound the same. Thumbs no, down. Thumbs down, those don't rhyme. Pi, I. Pi, I. Those sound the same. I think they sound the same. I'm Papa Square, my sides are four. I'm Cousin Rectangle, shaped like a door. Friends, what two words sound the same there? 
Great job for door. Those are rhyming words. I'm Brother Oval shaped like a zero. I'm Sister Diamond with a sparkle and a glow. That's kind of a hard one. Like and with? No, those don't sound the same. No. Zero glow. Yes. They sound the same at the end. They do. You guys are learning so much this week. Miss Tara, you said you had a book about shapes. Yes, I do. It's the Shape Song Swing Along book. It's written by Stephen Song, illustrated by David Sim. Let's read this book about Let's shapes. I have a shape collection and I use it to create anything I want to see or be or do or make. Is it work? Is it play? Is it music? Is it art? With my shape collection, all I need to do is start. Miss Tara, I see so many shapes. A circle, a square, triangle, and look, they're making our sun is a circle. It is. The rulers wow. are rectangles. That's a pretty cool book. He's going to use these shapes to make stuff. With a line, a line, I can make a circle, a circle, and a square with four sides, and a triangle with three. Look, they did draw the sun. They did. I drew a city with big skyscrapers. Look at all those shapes he used. Those, yes. I see a bunch of triangles. I see rectangles and triangles and squares and circles. Wow. And he drew a whole city. I draw people in the streets. It started on the paper with a line, a circle, a square, a triangle. Look at all those shapes he used wow. there. Hmm. I drew boats out on the water. Look, I see triangles and circles again, and rectangles and squares. Look, there's fish jumping. We counted fish yesterday, Mr. Thin. I drew a castle on the sand. I drew a beach side water slide. Oh, what a ride. I think they're having fun. Look at their they, face. They are. They are smiling. What shapes do you see on here, Miss Ruthann? I see a triangle. I see a circle, a square. His hat is a square. And all the sand castles are squares. Here's a star. Oh, wow, that's another shape. That's a shape. That is. And I never even had to stand in line, circle, square, triangle. I drew a party in the park. The DJ was, was a, a monkey. monkey. <laughs> That'd be funny. Everybody there was dancing, but no one was as funky. <gasps> monkey, funky. Those sound the Those same at the sound end. sound the same at the end. They are rhyming words. They are just dancing away. So no one was as funky as the lion. He used line, circle, square, square, triangle, triangle. Roar. Look at those shapes. Can you dance like a shape, then change into another? That's a funny move to make. Show your sister or your brother. What shape do you want to be, Miss Ruthann? Um, circle, triangle, square? I'll be a circle. Okay. I'm going to try to be a square. I'm going to put this arm up like this and this arm up like Ooh, this. Oh, that's a good square. All right. Now I'm going to turn into a circle. Are you ready? Yes. I'm going to turn into a triangle. Oh, ooh, that's a good one. <laughs> good job. Friends, I hope you tried to make shapes as well. Just making them with your body. Here at the Shape Song Swing Along Show, come on everybody, let's sing it together. We're going to say it. We can, we can do the line. line. Didn't think about the line, the oh, straight. Straight across. Straight across. The circle. Circle. You did a good circle, Mr. Thin. The square. square. The triangle. The triangle. We did really good. We make shapes in the day, and when the lights go out, we make shapes while we sleep because we're always dreaming about the lines, the circles, the squares, the lines, the circles, the squares, the triangles, the lines, the circles, the squares. Look at all those beautiful shapes. 
the end. I love that book and it's so bright Isn't and colorful. Neat? You guys can do a picture like that in your journals maybe today. Yeah, they can draw the shapes. That's yeah. a great idea. You know what, Miss um, Tara, I have a book today too. Oh. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. I like that one too. I like this one. I do too. If you guys want to get out your book, you can follow along as I read it. Great idea. It says, twinkle, twinkle, little star. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. She's pointing to it. Up above the world so high like a diamond in the sky yep. or I could say like a rhombus in the sky twinkle twinkle little star how I wonder what you are Sarah, Miss Tara, that kind of made me want to sing another song. What song would you like to sing? Can we sing Twinkle Twinkle Little Star? I would star? love to. I know some different motions to it that we use okay. sometimes. Can you show me? Because I'm They're not sure. Very simple. You just okay. twinkle like a star mm -hmm. and wonder what you are. Up above, you make a diamond. Okay. So very simple. All right. Okay. You think you we can do it? I think we can. Friends, can you sing along with us? All right. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are Up above the world so high Like a diamond in the sky Twinkle, twinkle, little star How I wonder what you are Good job! Yeah. Good job, Miss Ruthie. All right. So, I was thinking maybe you and I can do maybe like a rhythm or a pattern with some instruments today. We can. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take this one. You want? I think I'm gonna use a triangle. Oh, is that okay? Yeah. Since we've been talking because about we've shapes. been talking about. And look at mine. What is? Oh, is that a circle? I have a circle. That's round and, round. and you have Good a triangle. Job. All right. Let's see if we can make one together, and then we'll make one on our own. Okay. Let's see. So I'll do mine two times. And then mine two times? Yeah. That's okay. good. We'll do that. Oh, you want to do it together. Cool. So that's, a, we have a beat. And it was a pattern. And it was a pattern because it keeps going on and on and on. So I did too, and you did too. I like that. I bet our friends were doing a great job with that I as bet well. You they, were. they got their instruments out making a pattern yeah. with us. All right. You want to do one on your own? Okay. You can do it, Miss Tara. <laughs> I can do it. So if I tap this and then slap my knee, that's a good. That pattern. would be a good one, right? Mm hmm. That was a very easy yeah, pattern. Yeah, that's a very easy And it repeated over and over. And, over. And, over and I used my body, not just the instrument. I'm going to try that too. Okay. Right. So I'm going to do one, two, three. One, two, three. So wow. that was a pattern that was and a, a beat. Yes. You guys are good job. You're doing such a great You're job. You're so good at following those patterns. Yeah. And you want to look at some of our cards today, Miss Tara? We sure will. We've been working on rhyming words all week. So let's see. Eh, we'll do this one. Ooh, I don't know if we've done this one that's yet. That's pretty. This is a crown. A crown. A crown that a king or a queen, queen would wear. wear. Crown. Let's think of a word that might rhyme with that. Crown. Brown. Hmm. Brown, a color. That's yes. good. What about a frown? Oh. When I get sad or No upset. frowns today, Miss No frowns. Tara. Just smiles. What about, oh, this one. Look at that silly picture. It's a clown. 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 Crown. Crown. <laughs> it's hard to get those out, isn't it? Clown. Crown. Crown. They are rhyming words because they sound the same at, at the, the end. end. My husband doesn't like clowns. Have I told you I that? I don't like clowns either, Miss Hare. Uh, I think they're funny. But mm, I do not. It's a good rhyming word. It is it's a, a good, good rhyming, rhyming word. word. So, all right, we have a fan. 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 Friends, what's a word that you know that rhymes with fan? 
What about pan? Pan. Mm. Can. Oh, can. San. Oh. And that's not even a real word. San. San. What about a man? Man. man. Fan. Man, fan. They rhyme. They sound the same at the end. And we made up some of our other words, too, that we don't have cards yes. for. That's all right. We can make up funny words. Oh, I like this one. Hat. 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 Cat. Cat. Bat. Bat. These are easy ones. Hat. Cat. Bat. Sat. 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 Rat. Ooh. I like yeah, those. I don't like rats either. <laughs> Here is a cat. A cat. 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 Hat. They rhyme. Can you all think of some other words that might rhyme with cat and hat? Oh, good job. I'm hearing a lot of good words there. Uh, I like this purple one. This is a bag. 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 Oh, we like to play a game called tag. 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 Wag. Wag. Or rag. Rag. What about a flag? flag. Flag. What if I make up a crazy one? Twag. 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 That's a nonsense That's word. That's a nonsense word. But it word. rhymes. And it's silly. You can. We would still count that as a rhyming yep. word, though, because it sounds the same at the end. Twag is a silly word. Uh, have we done this one yet? I don't know. Cap. Cap. It's a cap. Cap. Tap. Oh, tap. That's a good one. Uh, Rap. Rap. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. What about swap? Swap. That's a nonsense word. It's a nonsense word. word. I like nonsense words. <laughs> what about a map? Map. Map. Map rhymes with cap. cap. They sound the same at the end. Rhyming words. Good job, friends. I think you are really working hard on those rhyming words. It's going to help you later on when you start to read. You can recognize some rhyming words in your reading when you're doing that. Oh, kindergarten readiness skills. Yes. Talk about getting ready to read. We are talking about birthdays. Oh. Is um, the readiness skill that we're focused on, on today. So the month that I was born in is September, and the day is the 16th. Miss Tara, what's the month that you were born in? My month is January, and the day is 7th, the 7th day of January. So my birthday is January 7th. January 7th. When is your birthday? Oh, I know a lot of friends that have birthdays in July. Really? A lot of my friends had birthdays in July, so they should be saying so that. So they are going to be turning Probably one year older. Yeah, having birthday parties. How exciting. <laughs> All right, so we have a special song to to tell yes so mm. i know that all of my friends that are watching and listening right now know to to tell it is my favorite song because it's so silly and you get to do fun and silly things so miss tara is getting that ready for us all right i think we're ready oh no oh. We got to get it back there at the beginning. We can't start in the middle of the song. No, I want to hear the whole song, Miss Sarah. Hey everybody, let's do the tootie ta. A tootie ta, 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 a Thumbs up, thumbs up, elbows back, elbows back, feet apart. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Thumbs up, thumbs up, elbows back, elbows back, feet apart, feet apart, knees together. Oh goodness, tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Thumbs up, elbows back, feet apart, knees together, bottoms up. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. 
a tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Thumbs up. Elbows back. Feet apart. Knees together. Bottoms up. Tongue out. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Thumbs up. Elbows back. Feet apart. Knees together. Bottoms up. Tongue out. Eyes shut. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Oh, keep your eyes closed. Tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Thumbs up. Elbows back. Feet apart. Knees together. Bottoms up. Tongue out. Eyes shut. Eyes shut. Turn around. Oh my goodness. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Shoo! That was so much fun. That's my favorite song, Miss Sarah. That is fun. Gets energy going oh and a smile on my face. Goodness. All right. So we have oh, talked about work. shapes today. We've sang and danced today. We've moved around. We talked about rhyming words and shapes. You want to go over our shapes again, Miss Tara? Sounds like a great idea. All right, friends. This is a good job, a circle. A circle. Oh. How many sides does this have? Good One, job. two, three and it's a triangle way to go friends this is a square and how many sides does a square have good job and how do you know what are all what is alike what is the same yes all four sides are the same and this is a rectangle Perfect. just like the door Oh, this one's the hard one. It's that, it's that crazy word. Rhombus. Great job. Way to go. Or a diamond. Diamond. Diamond or a rhombus. That's all of those. <laughs> Miss, do you want to get out our journals? I think it's Ms. time Tara? for our journals. You don't care, get your journal out and your crayons or whatever you're going to color draw with. I want you to draw your favorite part of today or something you learned today. Um, you can draw about the shapes that you learned, or you can draw about the books that we've read. Uh, I think I'm going to draw some shapes. I think I'm going to do too. I, I like to. I like talking about shapes. I like the shapes. Triangle. I'm going to change different colors, Miss oh. Ruthann. Circle. Mm. Now, a square has four sides, and they're all the, all the same. All the same. Okay. So they all have to be the same size. Yes. Well, Miss Tara, this is so much fun. I love drawing and painting. I love showing what I learned today. Yes. And then I can always tell my grandma or grandpa or mom or dad mm. or something when they come over. And then you can teach them about shapes. Yeah. I'm going to write the word shapes on mine. Oh. And maybe my name? Ooh, oh, that's maybe a good idea, Miss Tara. need to practice Tara. writing those names. Yes. I'm going to put one more thing. Oh. On mine. I didn't draw the rhombus. <gasps> that one's hard to draw. I'm going to skip that one for right bit. now. I can practice you know, that one later. You know what, Miss Tara? I have a trick to drawing a rhombus that I taught my kids last year, and they, it, it worked You'll really well. You'll have to well. teach me. I will definitely teach you. My rhombus sometimes turns yes, out I will lopsided. Teach you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, are you ready, Miss Tara? I'm ready, Miss Ruthann. All right. Oh, wow, you drew a city. Just like in your book. Oh, that's great. So I have a rectangle, and I have a bunch of squares, and a triangle, and a circle. Way to go, Miss Ruthann. I like how you use those shapes Thank to make you. something. Thank you. I just drew the simple shapes. <gasps> I have my triangle and my circle. And, and my you have square. all of them. I forgot the rhombus. Well, I'll show you. Watch, Miss Yes, Sarah. please show me that trick. So l let me look at your, look at your triangle. triangle. Your triangle, you did a great job doing your triangle. So you just write a triangle, just like that, okay? Mm -hmm. <gasps> and then another triangle. Wow. 
So the rhombus is two triangles put the together? The rhombus is two triangles put together. That's much easier. And all of my kiddos could do that. See, I tried drawing dots and that was difficult. Yeah. Oh. yeah. So just a triangle, turn it around. Turn and it upside down. One. And then as they practice and practice and practice, then they won't even have to turn it upside down. Wow. Let me see. Awesome. Your rhombus, Miss Tara. Wow. Way to I go. To Thank you, Mr. Ruth. You are so that welcome. Is wonderful. You are so Hope welcome. Hope my friends took time to write in their journals about what they learned today. Yes. Maybe they could share them on our comments. Share some of those pictures yes. of your journals. Yes. Are you doing it? And pictures. Oh, Send please. lots and lots of pictures. We love seeing pictures of you yes. guys having fun. And I definitely want to see some pictures of Tootie Tile with your tongue sticking out. <laughs> Do we have any comments or questions for today? Uh, we just have one comment and it says that you guys are doing a great job. Yay! Thank you very much. We enjoy it. Thank you. It's hard to interact when there's no kids here. Yes. So, <laughs> but we are trying it our is, best. But we hope fun. that you guys are having so much fun and are learning so many new things. And we cannot wait to have you back in the classroom. Yay. We miss you. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye, friends. Bye. Bye.